10-4 is line asymmetry. The objective is to guide exploration of the connection between reflections and line symmetry. Let's do some mental math and reflexes. 13 plus 6 is 19. 18 plus 5 is 23. 16 plus 9 is 25. 225 plus 7, 332. 146 plus 7, 153. 334 plus 8, 342. And finally, 438 plus 258, 691. 316 plus 496, 812. And 529 plus 144, 673. Turn to journal page 279. You don't need to share a transparent mirror because you're going to be working on this at different stages. Look at Math Masters page 311, which is located with all the other Math Math Masters pages for this unit. You're going to figure out what each picture would look like if it were complete and then use your transparent mirrors to complete each picture. Remember to use the recessed edge to draw the line of reflection. And then I want to discuss the results. So go ahead and look at the dog picture in Lesson 10-3. How are these drawings like the dog picture? And how are they different? Stop and think about that for a moment. I want you to compare them for what they are how, what are alike and I want you to contrast them and tell me how they are different. Hopefully you noticed that in the dog picture there are two sides that look exactly alike. They're congruent but they're facing in opposite directions. Here however the end results are single drawings instead of pairs of drawings. Notice that the lines of reflection are in the middle of the picture or objects not just outside as in the dog picture. When a line of reflection is in the middle of a picture object, it's called a line of symmetry. In this case, the picture objects are said to be symmetric. Use your transparent mirrors to draw lines of symmetry in the pictures of the bat and a turtle on Math Mathmaster, Masters page 312. Then cut out the other three pictures on the page and find their lines of symmetry by folding it. Remember that a picture may have more than one line of symmetry. Which picture has more than one line of symmetry? Stop and pause it if you haven't cut this out yet and haven't folded it. Once you have folded it, then hit the play button again to find out this answer. Your answer should be the bow. Exploring lines of symmetry of polygons. This is looking at your math journal page 279 and math masters pages 313 and 314. You need to cut out the polygons on math masters page 313 and 14. Then find all the lines of symmetry for each polygon by folding and then record the results in the tables and answer the related questions on journal page 279. You should have found that a regular polygon has the same number of lines of symmetry as it has sides. For example, a regular octagon has eight sides and eight lines of symmetry. Next you need to go to the math journal and do page 280. Remember to use your student reference book. The pages are listed here for you if you're struggling. Once you get done and you go check those pages, if you're still unsure of the answers or how you may have gotten some wrong, come back to the table and I'll help you with that. And the final thing you'll do for 10-4 is to do the study link. The page is shown here. Just make sure that you're doing the correct study length with where you're at now.